Hey, hey, hey! Hi, my name is Josephine and whether you are new here or not, welcome to my YouTube channel. There have been so many trends this autumn and winter that I have been wanting to join. There have been so many things that I wanted to buy, like all these chunky sweaters and like patterned stuff and knitted things and woolly dresses and I have loved the trends lately but I am completely broke <laughs> so I can't afford buying all of those new cool hip things but if you know me or if you have watched some of my previous videos you know that I love thrifting <laughs> so that is what I have done I haven't been doing it as much as I usually do lately because I'm broke but over the past one and a half month I'd say I bought a few things and that is what I thought I would show you today here is the bag oh it's heavy it's so heavy oh so let's dig into the bag shall we so one thing that I have been completely obsessed about the past like six months is the ribcage design from Levi's. So these gorgeous babes were the ones that I ended up buying and the retail price for these is about $150. I, on the other hand, ended up paying about $57 buying them from someone who was selling them online. This is what they look like on. They are so cool. They have a very like vintage 70s look to them and that is something that I love. They are in a size 28, 32 so they are quite long on me and a little bit loose around the waist but I don't really mind especially now that I have recently had surgery on my ribs. <laughs> I do really appreciate that they are kind of loose and chill to walk around with. If you just want to watch me struggle for a while, then uh, go ahead. I just want to show that I have to wear high heels if I wear these jeans because they are so long. And now over to the next thing in my bag that is... What is that? Is that another pair of ribcage from Levi's? It might just be. The retail price for these ones were also $150, but I ended up buying them for $46 from someone who was selling them online. Also, this video is not sponsored, but Thais, if you want to hook me up, then uh, I'm here. Anyhow, these trousers are in a size 26, 27 and they are quite short, but I really like to match shorter pants with higher boots, if that makes sense. I think that it's a really cool look. I have loved Colroid ever since I was like 11, <laughs> but when it comes to trousers, it's quite difficult to find a pair that actually fits you really nice, but I already knew that the ribcage design fits me perfect, so I was quite confident buying these because I just knew that they would fit, and yeah, I was right.
One trend that I have been loving this autumn and winter is cable knitted sweaters. This black sweater is from Sara and it is about $51 if you buy it in the store. Since I don't like buying things new and since I am also broke, I ended up buying one that was quite similar to it, but I bought it secondhand. I paid about $9 for this one. It's originally from the brand called Monkey in a size medium. And here is what it looks like on. One thing that I realized quite recently is that I don't have enough neutral colored sweaters. Especially now that I'm wearing a lot of colorful uh, trousers, I need some neutral pieces to match with those. And I'm not a person who can keep white things white, so I think that black is my go-to color. This one is also perfect because it's so easy to tuck into high-waisted trousers, which is what I mainly wear every day at the moment. Another trend that I have been seeing a lot of lately and that I absolutely love are these oversized like chunky cardigans. This one is from Sara and is about $43. This was kind of the inspiration that I had when I went to the thrift store. So guess what? Next up is a oversized chunky cardigan. I paid about $9 for this one at the thrift store and it was also completely new. It was made out of <laughs> better cotton. I'm not really sure what that means, but it sounds nice. And it also had an extra bottom, which is really convenient if one falls off. This is what it looks like on and you guys know me or maybe you don't. But blue is my favorite color. I love blue. I love blue in every shade. So this one is perfect for me. It is in a size extra large, so it has a really loose fit on me, which is something that I really like. And the huge sleeves are gorgeous. I may have also spent about seven trillion hours looking at the long dresses on the Zara website. I have never been a dress kind of girl, but recently I have loved the like jeans or trousers combined with a long knitted dress. It's my go-to right now. So this one is the inspiration for the next thing that I bought. I am obsessed with comfy clothing and you know that a piece is comfy when you just want to give it a hug. Let me just tell you, I am so happy with this buy. I paid about $17 for this dress and it is made out of 100% merino wool. It's from United Colors of Benetton and I think it would be like at least a hundred dollars if you bought it new. So this dress is just so extremely comfortable. I can see myself launching with a friend at a cafe or in a launch. <laughs> just sitting down having wine with someone that I really like. That is what I want to do when I'm wearing this dress. It's casual and proper at the same time, which makes it just such a good combination for a piece of clothing. The coldest part of the winter is still to come and I just know that this one will keep me really warm when that cold hits. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. I'm really happy that you are here and I hope that I will see you in my next video. <laughs> Bye!